Hello everyone, I want to share with you guys the one thing I have found with this primary arms uh, 5 to 25 by 56 first focal plane. That's a Lex scope. Okay, one thing, actually two things that um, um, like less than 100% satisfied. Okay, uh, now the scope up until now has been like 100% satisfactory, but the one thing I'm finding is that the windage turret over here. It is a little bit on the on the on the loose side. Now, not, it's not loose like as it moves, but uh, this should be a little bit tighter because, like, I'm moving it here. You see how it's that that should have been a little bit more, a, a, a little bit firmer. Should it should take a little bit more effort to move this. Now this is already zeroed in, so I don't want to. If I, I just go up, go up one click maybe. See one, go back one. Okay, so they do give you, uh, like right now I keep this capped. You definitely want to keep this capped because they also give you like exposed turrets. If you use the exposed turrets, yeah, this thing's going to like brush against your shirt, or your sleeve or something. That's never, ever, ever going to stay in place uh, with the exposed cap Unless it's like, or the exposed turret on the on the windage side, unless it's like like literally just like wrenching up, like resting on a table, okay. Um, like even in your in your gun bag, this thing's gonna rub against itself and that's gonna move. Okay, so you have to keep this thing covered. Okay, so pretend that they didn't give you an exposed turret. Now, uh, part of the reason why I'm, why I'm putting this video out there is because you might have. A 5 to 25 by 56, and yours might be like very stiff and firm because all the other adjustments on this are stiff and firm. The the elevation adjustment is stiff and firm. The, the 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 parallax is very stiff and firm. In fact, it's like I almost got to like I get calluses tr trying to turn the parallax, uh, which is fine. It's actually loosened up. So here's the thing: uh, these things I've noticed they do loosen up over time. Like the magnification adjustment here in the back. Um, I've had this now for about whatever, like three weeks. I've been working with it. It's definitely gotten a little bit like easier to work with. Okay, um, my concern is that the the windage adjustment here over time will get even looser, in which case that's going to be intolerable. Then it's going to have to go back to primary arms to tighten it up. Okay, so right now I think it's at a point where it, it's not going to like move on its own on the recoil. But if you hit this with like your sleeve or something or in, inside your gun bag, if this is not covered, if you don't cover this, uh, you're gonna you're gonna definitely lose uh, zero on your windage side. Now, now the other thing I want to mention that I'm starting to get a little frustrated with a little bit uh, is I'm finding that these these Allen screws, including this one over here. Because they give you these uh, these three Allen screws to hold these things in place. Um, on the recoil, they do come loose. Okay, and I just I, I took them out and I put a little bit of this Loctite on them, and I'm hoping that prevents them. You know, the, them from, like right now, like this is the this is the the collar uh, for your zero stop, um, and I'm finding that that is coming loose on the recoil. Like you know, because like I'll, I'll set it for a zero stop, I'll go out and I'll shoot it for you know uh, whatever a week or so. Then I'll, I'll like I want to change the zero or something, right? Or I'm shooting different ammunition or whatever. Put it on a different gun, and then when I go back to readjust this and I put the Allen key in there, I find that it has loosened up. Okay, so what I'm doing now is I'm I'm using this, just I'm putting some Loctite, Loctite on those Allen screws, and I'm hoping that that problem goes away. So same same deal with this one. This is the 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 cap that goes on it. I'm gonna, I'm putting a little bit of lock tight here on these allen on these uh allen screws and i'm hoping because every time i go to t remove them I, i'm finding that they're just coming off a little bit too easy okay um they haven't completely come off but they just they just they should be a little bit tighter when i set them i had set them a, a lot tighter than the way i'm finding them okay um so something for you guys to definitely keep an eye on um this is something i'm gonna i'm gonna continue to follow um, like i said i'm putting the lock tight on here I uh, just wanted to make you guys aware of that. But let me know if you guys have the same scope, this SLX 5 to 25 by 56 first focal plane. Uh, if you guys are finding that the windage adjustment is just a little bit too too loose for your taste. Okay? Thanks for watching. Talk to you all soon. Hey, everyone. So I'm back outdoors here, right? So I wanted to kind of leave myself open to the possibility that part of the reason why... 
the windage might feel so light to me is just because the knob is bigger and you got a lot more leverage um but as i compare this to this i mean the 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 elevations it is, it is a tad bit tighter not a whole lot tighter just a tad bit tighter now and like i said part of this impression that I'm getting is just the fact that these, you know, I mean, th these dials are just so big that you get a lot of leverage on it to turn them that they seem like they're light. But also the other possibility is that because, you know, like, like the, the parallax and, and, and the illumination are extremely tight. That's also making me think that these are on the light side. Um, but, uh, just, just, just keep an eye on that. Um, I'm not hundred percent convinced that it's me or it's not me, but I, my, my, my impression today is that these could have been a little bit, a little bit tighter, a little bit, you know, just a little bit more tactile, you know, a little bit more, you know, taking a little bit more effort to, to go from turn to turn, uh, you know, or go from click to click. So anyway, let me know what you guys think. If you guys have this same scope.